Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's the Double Chin Show. It's Mike. It's Dan. So, buddy, uh, there's a video that, um, you know, it's been going around the web a yeah. lot in the last couple of weeks. And we're a little late to the game, but we still want to talk about this. Yeah, when you told me about this, I was, like, kind of confused. You were like, um, so let's talk about the video. Basically, uh, there's a YouTuber who does, I guess, these social experiments or maybe pranks. pranks slash, or yeah, whatever. All kinds of stuff, right? Right. And then he, there's, like, a hidden camera and he records people's reactions. Um, and what he's doing is he's, he pretends to be a homeless man and he's giving money out rather than taking money. Right. And it's, it's, but the important thing is he's trying to give a message to the person, which is on a sign that says, no one has ever gone bro uh, broke from giving. Yeah. And, he's, and then he goes on to say, like, I have all that I need. So this makes me feel, I guess, rich. Okay. Right. So let's, let's, just, let's just look at this just from a purely, despite what he did, let's look right. at this from the surface. Right. Uh, it's a poor person giving money to a rich right. person. Um, I think there is like a, a feeling in the world mm -hmm. that maybe it's uncomfortable or awkward or, or considered an insult. Yeah. Almost if like somebody who's who has less than you give you money. Yeah. But here's my question to right. you though: What if he gave you like a like a like a let's say you meet somebody in a foreign country? Yeah. And uh, you, obviously they look like they're you know worse off than you, but right. they give you like a like a local specialty, like a lo local bread. Sure. Right? Try that. Would okay. you be insulted? No. So why is it that when if someone gives you gives people money, right. they feel insulted, but not like something like a nice piece of bread? Well, because most of the time, I think money in this society equals status, mm -hmm. and a lot of people who have money care about the status. I'm not saying everybody, but usually, right? Right. Like as evident by these these people that you see walking by, they oh they say stuff like, "Dude, I could buy you." Yeah. Or <laughs> at the end. Basically, the guy gets into an altercation with another man, right. who, and he keeps pointing out the fact that he drives a Mercedes. Right. So money equals C class. C class. C class. Oh okay, yeah! Wow. Wait wait, wait, wait. I just gotta tell you, C class is the lowest class in Mercedes. And I actually didn't know. I don't know much about Mercedes, so you you, you told me this. <laughs> and, and he and it's not fifty thousand dollars. It's actually Mercedes did a campaign that they're under thirty thousand dollars now. Twenty nine nine. Okay. All right. So it's like, bro, you got the lowest class in Mercedes. Um, anyways, uh, so anyways, yeah, money, like, of course, it, it doesn't feel good because you're, you're like, yo, is this, okay, honestly, I gotta say, the way he's doing it, like, I, I understand what he's trying to do. But he's kind of antagonizing people. I, I, th I agree, like, I, I, re I like the message. Yeah. I like the message of if you, okay, because I'm always big on what is rich. Rich to me is not having money. It's it's how enriched your life is. Sure. Because I'm not rich. I think, I think most people feel like that. Or I think the way he did it would definitely get negative reactions like this. Right. Like you said, it's 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 a little bit antagonizing. It is. It's a little bit forced. Right. Like, yo. He, He's like, like, here's 10 bucks. Right. Why? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm right. just trying to give you 10 bucks. Take the 10 bucks. Like, right. stuff. That's, stuff. that's weird, right? Right. Because, because like, Ask yourself, like you, just, like if you, if a homeless guy try to give, first of all, first of all, he's pretending to be homeless. Yeah. He's not homeless. He's right. like, I'm not homeless. First of all, a homeless guy would never give people money. Like in term, like this is what I'm, this is what I'm saying. If a homeless guy actually felt rich by giving, he doesn't need to prove it because you feel it in your heart. Do you know what I'm saying? Well, he's they trying would to do, prove a point. First of all, let's say this happened in New York. Right. Uh, my first reaction would be. This is some kind of scam. It yeah. Or scam or something or, is going on. Or I'm being punked. Right. Which they were, <laughs> but like like you said, um, a homeless person. Mm -hmm. You know, even there was another video I saw. It was right. really really nice. It was kind of like the circle of love kind of video. Okay. Um, and the homeless person did give something, but right. he gave something in in the, in the you know in a form of like helping somebody carry something or do, right. do a nice opening act. a door or something right. like that. Whatever. So it's kind of weird to give out cash. It is because you're. Because in, at the end of the day, what he was doing is not, um, he was trying to prove a point. Right. And he wanted to show, it was more like he, he tried to get a reaction from people. Yeah. And he wanted to show what's pe in some of these people's hearts. Which to me, that, that's a good thing. Because a lot of people, what we saw is kind of the, kind of the uh, not the worst of humanity, but definitely like pretty bad. Well, he also, yeah. I'm sure that's not the only people who, who stopped. He picked right. out probably the extreme ends, some being right. really nice, some being right. the opposite of that. There was two that was really nice. One girl right. actually was like, no, you keep it and here's what no, I got. She lied. What was that? She lied because uh, uh, when the first time she thought he was asking for money, right. she's like, I don't have any change. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but we all do that. We all do that. But actually, actually, I never have money. I, you know, I never have yeah, cash. Yeah, you don't have any cash. So every time I walk by homeless person, I'm literally like, yo, bro, I don't have any cash. Right. 
Like I always have a credit card. Um, but yeah, and then there was another. It looked like an Asian guy Asian who was guy. like, who was like, oh, I like your message, bro. Yeah, Here's Asians. My, yeah, we're kind. But but like. I, I'm thinking, I'm always like, what would I do in this situation? Well, first of all, I wouldn't take his money. Yeah. And second of all, if it's a nice message, I would probably do the same. I wouldn't give him more money mm -hmm. because they probably did it like, they're like, oh, uh, oh, he, that's cool. It touched me, so I'll give you money. Like, dude, I'll give you money not because you touch me. Like, it's because if I have some money, I'll give it to you. I, see, but, for me, I'm so, I, I you know, I, I spend maybe too much time in New York. Yeah. So I would think of, like I said, either either it's a it's a scam, either right. I it's a, it's some kind of show, right. or, you know, I would think it's a way that, there's a new way people came up with to get, get money. Right. You know, right. instead of, you know, like if he, if you, if the homeless person offers me, me money, right. I'd be in, I'd be, I'd be feeling like I need to give uh, them more money. I don't know. Right. I would just feel like, you know that that's something right. that they're trying to pull. That's what you feel like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Um, but like this whole video, even the message, I think, um, I think what this social experiment is trying to show is that okay, rich people, a lot of them ver feel very much entitled, feel like they're right. they're in a cloud where right. they they have a certain amount of status, and if right. you, uh, they're untouchable. Yeah, well, like they some they, some they feel like they, they suffer are because like, of the money. Yeah, they're so. Arrogant. Yeah. If you somehow make them feel like they may be a little um, less than you, right. they get really upset right. because they're like, "Well, I'm I'm better than you. Right. I'm better than you. Right. So you should always, you know, maybe take from right. me or right. kowtow to me. I should never have to take anything from you." It's, it's a right. pride thing. It's an arrogance thing. I also think like um, if if there's like a soup, like if there's like really super rich people, like there are super rich people that act like they are very humble right like they aren't millionaires right so to me like that's just the type of person you are at your core so if you see somebody like this and you're like oh that's cool you might give money you might not but i think the people that are moved are yeah. maybe like not totally rich and they and they they have to work for the money or they have money and they see money as as something that resembles status and happiness. It's also it's it's a big part of it is a show off thing. Like right, the guy's right. like, you know, I have a black card. I drive a Mercedes. Like right. it's it's Yo, all you, you got a black card. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not, uh, the, not the same kind. Not the same. Uh, uh, so uh, uh, yeah, um, there's there's a lot of people that utilize this as a symbol of like of just basically to show off. Like right. this guy, he drives a Mercedes, but he, like you say, he's driving the cheapest kind of Mercedes. Right. But see, he still had to get that Mercedes. Ah. Instead of, let's say, being a uh, you know, reasonable guy and spending that 30 grand maybe on a loaded CRV, like I would have done. A Lotus? Oh, a loaded, loaded CRV CR with a nice moon roof with a, you know. I agree with the moon roof. You yeah. know, I agree with the moon roof. I'd rather spend $30,000 on that than maybe right. spend 30 grand on the cheapest, you know, yeah. model of Mercedes just because I can get like a little Mercedes symbol. Right, right. That just me but also i feel like this is very geographical okay he did this experiment in la right i think you would see different reactions if you did it let's say in new midwest. york yeah and also the midwest yeah. i think Maybe definitely in the south yeah. i think you'll see different reactions right. well i this is what i take it as this is not to this is a social it's not like so much social experiment look to me this is this is a, a prank not a prank, but you know this. This is similar to remember that video where the girl walks down the yeah, street, yeah, yeah, um, and people holler at her. Yeah. I had a problem with that video. I mean, I again, these I have problems, and I and I like some of the things they right. do. And to me, it's the same thing. It's to elicit a reaction. Right, I agree. And that's why it has five million views in yeah. climbing. Yeah. You know, like I do like that guy, uh, whoever that guy is. Yeah. I do like the fact that he's putting a positive message through the board. Yeah. Um, Look, it, to me, but it, to me, I would have done it a different way. You know, if I wanted to show that um, richness doesn't come from how much money you have, I would have showed, um, say, a person who's rich or who's, does, who's not homeless. For example, like they go to the subways and they play the violin for people. And then people come, there's nothing to put money in. And, and then people would be like, yo, I, I want to give you um, some money. And he's like, no, I'm actually, I make, you know, I'm in an orchestra. I make $150,000 a year. I don't need money, but actually playing music for you guys makes me happy. Something like that. To me, that's, okay. that shows richness more. Also, I feel like, especially um, the creator of, of this video, mm -hmm. um, the reason I didn't like this video that much was because we mentioned that he kind of uh, antagonized a lot of people, especially right. towards the end right. with the guy with the Mercedes. Right. If you, if you, I feel like this guy really isn't believing his message. Right, because he's like, definitely attacking the Then you got like too. the music playing, right. then you got him just basically going, keep walking, keep walking, bro. You yeah. ain't going to do nothing. Keep right. walking. I'm like... Because to That's, me, that kind of goes against your whole thing definitely. here. If you practice what you preach, like, yeah. like 
Honestly, like me and you the other day, like some guy almost attacked us right. because of my driving skills. Which and, is horrendous. Which is horrendous. Yes. Literally, this guy almost attacked me yeah. and you yeah. in New York City. Yeah. And this happens to people all the time. Right. So, but honestly, like me and you, we practice what we preach. Yeah. So we're like, I actually even apologize yeah, to the you, guy. You did really well. You did really well and, in that situation. Right. And so, so to me, if, if this is a video truly about the, yeah. truly about the message, I think um, he would have done. He should have done it a different way and not shown that he was really trying to prove a point to somebody. Right. Like, like so, like, yeah, dude, you got no humbleness in your heart. Right. Like, I would have just let him. Oh, walk I away. got humbleness, but yeah. you don't have humbleness. And I need to let exactly. you know. I really didn't like that part. But uh, right, because being humble doesn't mean I need to make right. sure you know. Right. Humble literally is. You know what, yeah. Mike? Okay. You're not humble. That's I fine. feel sorry you for know. you. See you later. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, but I do, but look, is it entertaining? Of course it's entertaining. Yeah. Cause you're like, can we call it for what it is? Yeah. It's a YouTuber who came up with a concept that he figured that this could draw a big crowd. Absolutely. That's what it is. Absolutely. So because it's not, it's, it shouldn't be, it's not anything right. more than that. Exactly. And you know what? That it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. Because it's, he's not, he is an entertainer. He's exactly. not, a, you know, he's not Dr. Phil. He's not branding himself as somebody that's like, I'm going to, you know, I have a positive, I'm going to change the world. Right. This and that. Because obviously if you're like, well, if, if you do believe in that, you probably wouldn't have picked a fight with the guy, you know, tell him to walk away. And the Basically, whole tone like, of right. your delivery. Like, if right. you notice, his whole tone, whenever he tried to give the money, right. is kind of like almost like it's poking, poking yeah. a little bit. It's like, no, nah, I don't need the money, but you, yeah, you, do. you do. You take it. Yeah. You know, like, if you were really trying to, like, and he was like, yo, look at my sign, look at my sign. Yeah. And they were like, it's just, it's just, honestly, though, um, I do, I do like that he made the video because I really have a problem with a lot of people who think money is the answer to everything. Yeah. So it really does show that there's some scum. I mean, a lot of these people are scummy. Like, I could buy you, bro. Right. Like, you know what? If you were, if that guy was rich, if I was rich and somebody did that to me, I'd just be like, oh, that's that's a cool message. Like, and just walked away. I'd be like, yeah. no, I don't need your money. Well, again, I think I it's, it's, it's also about where you are. LA people might be different. I, th I think that reaction might be the same if you, let's say you did it on Wall Street oh. here in New York. Dude, that would be insane. Uh, but like, you know, also if you right. took this to Kansas City, I right. think it would be completely different. Completely because, different. You know, not to not to generalize, yeah. but a lot of people over there are, you know, they're 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 very like, uh, yeah. you know, what I calm I, and yep. I think in Kansas City, you know, you're from you're from the Midwest. Yeah. You know, people might be like, they're they're a lot more religious, and yeah. they might be like, oh, you know, like they might even tell them like, hey, I, I'm totally feeling rich. I'm not rich. Um, they might even try to bring him to church. Or yeah, not, like, not hey, to generalize, yeah. but like I think there there will be a difference if you different different types of people. Different, yeah. Like that guy said, like, this is LA, yeah. baby. Right. Because those guys clearly are like, you're you're. I feel littler than you now, yeah. and I need to rise up. Yeah. But people in the Midwest might be like, they don't have that. You know, they might yeah. just be like. Hey, you need some help? Like, yeah. Well, right? I mean, look. But, you know, th when I was in living in uh, mm -hmm. in Missouri, actually, one of the rich, uh, one of the richest uh, panhandlers mm -hmm. in the country was from Kansas City. He wow. made like hundreds of thousands of dollars a year wow. because you know, in the Midwest, you don't see right. panhandling everywhere. Right. So you, you, everyone wants to help. Right. I even did it when I was poor as a college student. I saw a I saw a homeless person with a sign. I yeah. gave him sixty bucks. That was like sixty dollars. That was like two hundreds in today's wait, money wait, 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 wait. in college. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I was like, I was wow. like, well, I don't, I don't. He'll probably, you know, use it much more than I will. So that's what happens. Like, oh those, my gosh. You know, people are much simpler. Yeah. But well, uh, I, despite how this video was done, and of course, you know, like, look, we're YouTubers. He's YouTubers. I'm not knocking what he's doing because, right. hey, if you get five, six million views, that's a lot yeah. of views. Um, but I, I think, a video aside, why we want to talk about this is I do really like the message of. If you it, richness is not to me, it doesn't equate how much money you of have. Of course, it's how happy you are with yourself. You know, like in life. Right. All right, you're born with nothing. Right. When you die, you, you can't take anything with you. Exactly. So that's just the way right. it is. All right, guys, let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments below. Thank yeah. you so much for watching. See you later. Peace. Yo, is that all that guy does? Is those kind of videos? No, he does. Usually, he just does simple as pranks. Oh yeah. That's the first time he did like a. Yo, that dude definitely was had a problem. Like that dude, like some roid rage.